Hello everyone, and welcome back to Val Plays Minecraft on the Nebulous. There you go, saying hi to Al Russia, who just logged in. Uh, I wanted to show you guys some of the uh, things that I've been doing. Uh, got a little updates here, you got some cool little fire coming under here, it's because a cool little effect, a little jet table there, just because. Um, I've made the walls a little higher, um, this outer wall, uh, by four blocks. 66 trees, interesting. And what else have I done? Um, I kind of spiffied up the room below here, uh, this level. This is kind of what I'm, kind of what I'm looking for. What I want my hallways and stuff to look like: stairs, slabs in the lower half there, and then stairs on the top. Uh, smooth stone up here. I want to incorporate nether brick eventually uh, when we can start crafting it, uh, and kind of now as well. Uh, maybe just in strips or in accents or I'm not sure. I like the brick look, so. Uh, but this is kind of what I'm looking for. And I think that's about it so far. What I'm working on today is the base. I want to raise it up a little bit, start working, calculating the next levels. So I'm going to start um, adding more levels to the, tr to the tower here, the transportation tower. Figure out where my next floor is going to be. I'm probably going to skip one and go up again. Uh, one minecart division, I mean. And, uh, yeah. Got the second beacon in place. Uh, I've done some map exploration here. So this is the second zoomed out. You can see the desert, the jungle, plains, the big forest behind me, little jungle there. Uh, and then this one's even more zoomed out. It's more ocean. You can see the big plains behind the forest and the taiga on the other side there. Uh, more jungle and there's more snow over here. No more swamps. But uh, there's a lot of cool bays and stuff all around here. I'm gonna uh, build in this whole area. This is my this is my domain right there. All right, well, when we get to it, and I'll show you guys some updates here soon. Hello everyone, and welcome back. So, see a little bit of what I've been working on. Uh, pretty much, I have raised the torch tower and the transportation tower itself up. Uh, skipping one level, going to the next one. And that's the level that's going to be on the next floor. Uh, that's also going to be the kind of the outside part where I can walk around um, before the real part of the tower goes up, I think. Um, it looks like a pretty good level for that. Um, and then I'll have all my other uh, towers and stuff go up from there. Uh, it'll be good. So I've started laying the stone work, but uh, it's going to take a lot of stone, and I'm out of stone. I'm low on real iron, so I need to... Um, do some mining. So that's what I'm going to work on now is do some strip mining. I've got my silk touch, my fortune, and I'm going to go to town. Um, let's go look there. And uh, I'll show you guys some progress uh, a little later. I'm going to do a lot, a lot of that and uh, yeah. Fun times. Well, welcome back. You can see what it's starting to look like in here with the ceiling. It's nice and high. I'm going to put some more lighting in here, yeah, but I'm not quite done yet. i got this little section here for the uh, front of the half circle, and then I still have the back part there. Uh, i got the sounds off because it's raining. It's really loud, as always. Oh, did it just stop? Of course, it just stopped. Uh, so I'm going to get back up here and finish this off. Use the ladder, I can use the uh, minecart system. And then I'll do this back part here. The uh, potion room is at the perfect height here where this goes over and I can still get up here and access everything. So it's working out pretty perfectly. I made a mistake and fell. So I just got this little hole here and then the back side. All right, uh, I'll show you when I'm done. All right, everyone, welcome back. I've completed the uh, floor here, this next level, and oh, cave sound. Must be a cave directly down there. 
Uh, and now my plan is kind of figure out the diameter of this next section here. Basically what I want is this part here to have a walkway all the way around the outside here, outside, and then somewhere in here I will have a, uh, you know, a smaller circle around like that, um, and that'll be the base of the, you know, tower going up even higher. Um, and I'll put a bunch of decoration and like arches and all kinds of cool stuff around here. Um, and then jutting off from this will be like the tops of towers like this. It'll go out to uh, watchtowers all the way around. So that's what this is going to be. Um, it's kind of an idea of what I'm going to do. I'm going to figure out the sizes here and how wide circle I want and uh, I'll work on that. I'll show you guys some progress in a little bit. Okay, here's a look at it. Feels pretty good. As far as concentric Minecraft circles are concerned. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, so yeah, I like it. Might go to another level, cap off these little doors here, and then we'll start looking at these towers, all that good stuff. I may also pay a little visit to the iron farm. I need to get a bunch of iron. Uh, I want to flesh out the beacons down there uh, to get the power range farther so I can have the, my powers, you know, as I'm working up here. Because I'm, I'm out of range now. I no longer am in range of it. So, uh, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Got a couple of people on. Goody, Zenith. Excellent. Well, I'm going to get back to work and show you guys some more in a little while. Okay, everyone. So we got three high. I turned off the sound because of the rain. And right in the middle here, I'm taking another three block section, you know, the nine blocks that are here. Make a path out <clears throat> to this little side tower. Excuse me for the cough there. Um, and this is kind of what I'm looking at. It's a uh, 11 diameter, I believe. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five out of the middle. This one's the middle. And I made that one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine away from here well this is the line so it's actually eight attached eight away uh, and then boom so it's actually it's like nine away from the side that's that's what it is yep and then five out come up to here and I'll wrap it around It'll be a little lookout tower and I'll put a pillar down there and it's conveniently right over this hill right here along this curve in the little river bank so it'll look really awesome and then I'm going to put these on the other edges and then see what kind of corner tower I can get, a diagonal one. I want to get a diagonal one in here too. I think that would be awesome. Um, but first I need to do the two. Well, I have this one. Once I have this one, I have those over there. That's kind of a special case. So we'll see. We'll see. I'll put the other two in probably after this one and we'll see what they look like, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, for now, I'll probably finish this off, uh, at least the top part here. And then I might do some iron farming. Oh look, a flying bat outside. Interesting. All right, here we go. Here's the first one. I put stairs underneath all the way around. And then I made the pillar, you know, a three by three pillar. Stairs all the way around, stairs all the way around. And now with the new awesome corner stairs, get a cool looking thick pillar. It makes it really look like it's got some strength to it. Uh, I tried just a single block and that just looked, that was not right. Not going to suffice. Uh, I could do more of a gradual uh, change here, uh, considering that it's two blocks of smooth. Uh, like I could do a ring of slabs and then stairs, and I'm considering that. This looks okay, um, but I think I might actually want to do that um, make it more of a gradual look and change I think I'm gonna try that and show you guys what it looks like all right here's a little peek uh, from up close go ahead and uh, get rid of my scaffolding here This is how I build underneath stuff. A 
literally put like scaffolding, add a dirt, and then somewhere I'll have a pillar, a ladder pillar like this to get up to onto the scaffolding. Makes building and awkward uh, spots underneath things much easier. It's dirt, it's easy to break. If it falls and it disappears, no one cares. Got tons of dirt. Alright, so this is what it's looking like now. I like it with the ring of slabs there. Uh, I like that a lot more. That looks a lot better. Uh, I think this is what I'm going to stick with. Um, I could even go another... Well, I can't go another ring because of the corner right here. So this is how that square fits. Uh, I could just go ahead and put slabs underneath the stone there. And I think I might go ahead and do that. Uh, and then it'll look uh, pretty darn good. Nope, not gonna put uh, slaps here, cause look at that, lighting glitch, lighting glitch. Nope, not gonna happen. I'll leave it the way it is. Beautiful. All right, and uh, since we're done, let's go ahead and show you what the top looks like so far. I haven't put in the stone all the way over. Let it come out, and this is kind of how big it is. Not bad, right? Not bad. We actually got a little extra space out here too. Now I'm going to uh, cover it with uh, stone slabs like that. Just like that in fact. So we can show you how that's going to start. Do this. Dun 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 dun. Okay, go ahead and take out these torches. Okay, so now I'll go ahead and do the every other part like that. Start in the middle. Oops. That. And do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Alright, so now every other one. Boom. And you have uh, the double here. That works just fine. That, skip that one and it's not even oh because I uh, skip one like that there we go and then this bottom part here I will uh, slap so you stand up like this I'm going to show you the whole part but you want now you can walk up here you can't fall off but you can uh, kind of see out a little bit like that I like it you can get up here shoot stuff I may even change this from smooth stone slabs to something else I don't know, I like the idea. And maybe I'll do uh, a path. And do something like this. And then have this um, path going all the way around, like uh, in the middle. Kind of like that idea. And then when you come up onto the towers, they'll be raised like so. Uh, and maybe I'll even have a lip on the side like this. Oops, not like that. Seeing as how I'm going to have it, uh, the stone extend on here as well, like so. And then from here, you know, I'll go every other. Oh, I ran out. Well, you get the idea. Since I'm going to do something like that, maybe I'll have this, and then the, and on the floor level here in the middle. Or maybe I'll just turn this whole thing into stone slabs, like the, this ground. Uh, I, w I was thinking I wanted it stone, because I like you know mixing in the smooth stone. Uh, but maybe I'll do something different. But this is the general idea. And... Uh, I think this is going to do it for me this episode. I need to uh, 
gather more stone and go hit the iron golem farm so I can power up these beacons. And I think that's what I'm going to do now. I got a good amount of progress done with this. And I'm going to replicate this tower, like I said, on the back and on that side. The four cardinal directions. Well, the three, since there's that over there. And, uh, yeah, next time I'll show you guys all that. Thank you all for watching. And uh, please like, subscribe, comment, give me some feedback, all that good jazz. Uh, check out the rest of the people on the Nebulous. Uh, right now I'm the only one on. But uh, that's how it goes. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you all next time.